Hey guys, Mike Carpenter here. Welcome to another video. Today I'm at the Pasco train yard, uh, checking things out. Uh, it looks, um, man, there's just not that many reefers down here. It must be due to a lot of the businesses that are closed for the COVID uh, virus. Um, Cause usually I come down here and see maybe 20 all lined up, you know, and that's kind of like the bread and butter of these, uh, of these videos, <laughs> those reefers. But today, I don't know, it's looking pretty scant. So let's go ahead and uh, get started and drive down the line of cars and see what we can find. So I just, uh, you just watched my intro a minute ago and um, I wanted to add on that um, after I was finished at the, at the Pasco train yard, um, I came down here to uh, uh, Columbia Basin Blends and usually they've got uh, freight cars, hoppers, I think it is parked down here. Um, and very little graffiti, um, sometimes monikers on them. But today, I I really scored. <laughs> I saw more train riding on those cars than I have ever seen there. So I just wanted to let you know, um, when this uh, video comes uh, to an end, um, you'll see this additional footage um, as, you know, like a follow-up to the video. So, uh, you know, hang in there and uh, watch till the end of the video. Okay, so as you can see, it is pretty empty down here. There's a couple reefers way back there. Hmm. It's unusually empty. That's another security truck. Don't know what the story is. Here comes another one. And another one. And I think another one. They're very, they're very busy today. Busy, busy. I guess it's all hands on deck. Okay, so let's keep going. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. We've got like another seven to go. It's hard to tell on this little screen though what I'm looking at. A lot of times it's not till I get home and look at it on the uh, you know 24 inch screen that I can see, you know, what it was that I was uh, either missed or you know thought I was looking at. I usually take two photos. Got the tripod, so I'm using the window as a tripod. I will say one thing though, when I first started making videos back in uh, August, I didn't, I had no idea that I would be making, uh, you know, like uh, doing videos for like, uh, you know, freight train riding. It's kind of interesting. You know, it's kind of interesting the uh, twists and turns that life takes, and but it's been a pretty interesting uh, experience. But like I said, I'm no in past videos. I'm no, uh, I'm no expert. I'm just a guy who likes to make videos, and uh, likes, uh, you know, I like art. And this uh, train riding is like I don't know. It's a really good. Uh, blend of my interests. Let's keep going here. There's a couple very uh, nice ones over here. Nice. When I say nice, I mean like nice like in color. I know that, you know, train riders, you guys out there, you're like, you know, looking for, you know, specific names and possibly even your own names. But I don't ask questions. But I love color. I keep saying that every video, you know. I don't know, what can I say? If I was a, you know, if I was a girl, I'd probably paint my fingernails all the time, all different colors. My wife used to have like a whole set of uh, fingernail polish. It was pretty fun, I used to go through there and just look at the uh, colors. You know, she had like, I don't know, 100 different kinds. 
she offered to she offered to paint my fingernails a couple times but it's like no way <laughs> no way in hell I like color but not that much this one here has like these uh they paint like the stars you know as if like something's uh, gleaming you know so it looks like it's sparkling I really love that uh, really love that effect but, um, I don't know how hard that is to do um, but uh, make sure I'm still recording I don't how I don't know how, how hard that is to achieve I with a can of spray paint I'm not sure I'm always amazed at these uh, these effects that uh, you guys you train riders train riders get um, because even if I had a paintbrush, you know, some of the stuff, I don't think, I feel like I'm a pretty accomplished artist, but I don't think I could achieve, you know, what, uh, what some people achieve with a can of spray paint. That is just, uh, I guess that's the other thing about train riding that really just amazes me. These security guys, they must be bored or something, because, I don't know, they keep driving out and about and around, and um, seem like they're sort of, uh, what's the word, um, they're hovering. So, anyway. Oh, hey, here's one of those guys in those little carts that drives around. It's probably uh, the guy that I know. Let's see, Let's see if I can recognize him as I go by. Let's see if he slows down. He was okay. I realized he's just doing his job, so, you know. Actually, I wouldn't mind having his job. Can you imagine having his job? I would be like, I would be like, um, with my camera. I'd be with like with my video camera, and I'd just be, you know, I'd just sp spend my day doing my job and then taking photos at the same time. Or not taking photos, but taking video. That would be, uh, man, that would be really, really cool. Or I could always uh, I could always ask him to wear my GoPro. <laughs> That's a weird one. Kind of looks like it's tie dyed or something. Okay, so now this one is. Uh, it's like got this huge lettering on it. It's huge lettering. I can't even get the whole thing into the into one shot. So I'm gonna have to do two shots. Maybe splice it. It's TFL, which stands for too fucking long to get it onto the uh, the, the photo to take photos of it. <laughs> Let's keep going. Here's. Coast K O S E. The person is everywhere. I mean, if I didn't know better, I'd say the person lives here in the Tri Cities area, but I don't think so. Oh, I'm at a weird angle. Hope I don't get stuck. So there's some writing here, uh, but it's like pretty, it's almost like balloon letters. Mm. You can hear that. I've got a belt that's loose too. You can hear that thing squeaking. It's really annoying. I've got to get that looked at. I've got some uh, road trips I want to take this uh, in May. And uh, so I got to get that fixed.
Okay, and that squealing you hear in the background, that is not my belt. My belt on the car sounded like that, man. I'd be scared. That'd not be good. So in here, it's got, um, it's hard to see. It's black, it's got like yellow marks on it. I can't tell what it is. It's like, um, it's not, oh, I don't know if you guys, I don't know if you guys heard that or not. Wow, that was loud. Hmm. Okay. I definitely recall seeing this last November or December. I met this uh, this company. You can find uh, you know this line of cars here. Uh, for the most part, usually there's nothing on them, but uh, today, well, there's one. Okay, and we have this right here. It's a little uh, it's a little weather worn. Let me just back up so I get the whole thing in there. A little weather worn. Um, let's get a close up look while we can. It's not real crisp. I tend to like the crisp stuff, but yeah. All right. I think there's one more down there. Let's keep going. Okay, so we have something here. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty weather looking. Um, but you know, maybe it's, uh, maybe it's something vintage that, uh, you haven't seen before or for maybe a long time, depending on how old you are. We have Nor. Okay guys, I am gonna make this really quick here. I found these. And we don't, I don't see much in the way of a train riding here very often. So I really wanna get the, uh, I really wanna make the most of this. Of course we have this big light pole in the way. See how it's quite, uh, it's quite runny there. I always like to see the technique. I don't know if that's technique, but it kind of helps me to understand how it was produced. You have this uh, interesting, like, caricature right here. Like I said, I don't, um, oh, I don't see train riding very often down here on these cars. So this is like um, a pretty good find. Okay. There you have it. You can see today? Saw some pretty good stuff, I think. Um, I just want to tell you guys, uh, thanks for uh, supporting this channel the last uh, several months. I really appreciate your support. Uh, it means a lot. And I hope you guys uh, stay healthy and safe out there uh, with that uh, coronavirus, uh, you know, circling the world. Um, if you guys uh, like this video, give it a like. Um, share and subscribe. And I look forward to uh, bringing you guys uh, more, uh, more, freight, uh, more freight train, train riding videos in the future.